Yes. Knee up straight. Here we go. Strong. Oh, oh, straight. <laughs> that was a straight line. Man, I sh do, do you mind if I check, man, and I fucking, I, if sure. I get you and I... Yeah, yeah, yeah. Because I'm going to learn. Like, it's the best way to see someone who does it the best, it's, you know, and learn from it. It's hard know? to do it right now because we're, this floor is so slippery. I wish I had a towel. Do we have a towel in? Uh, yes. Hey, is that best if I kick that? Grab a towel. Hey, 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 can you grab a towel really quick from back there? Thank, thank you. Because this shit is... Look how hard George works. Dude, it's looking good, good, man. Yeah, I bad. mean... Can you imagine if, what would happen if uh, someone got hit with that shit in the UFC, yeah, right? Yeah, seriously. They'd go to the hospital. No, no. Yeah. Man, this can really cause a lot of damage. The, the yeah. internal organs, man, thank you. bad. What about that... Uh, the 360. Oh, I showed him that too. That's Man, a nice it's one crazy. Too. If I can kill that vacuum with it. The so I just, I just got here. George and, and Joe been working on uh, some sidekicks yeah, on my George way over here. so hard. This whole place is drenched in sweat and GSP oil. He exudes a natural body oil. That's a lot of people <laughs> think he greases. Hey, you know what? He's this so is Vaseline, smooth. man. He's so smooth. He's Vaseline. Nah, nah. All right, so here's the kick. Wait a second, wait a second. Man, the best psychic I've ever seen in my life. Tell me when you're ready. Go ahead. Oh, fuck, man. Now, notice how everything goes in a straight line. Yeah. What you're doing wrong is your knee is low, and as you're kicking, you're going up. Okay. And in the going up, you lose a lot of the energy. You don't want to go up, you want to go straight. Straight line. Man. Straight line. Straight. Straight line. Always straight. Man, it's fucking crazy. And, and when you finish, I think I see what? you're kind of straight line. You're not like No, this. all power. All the power's in it. Bam! All the power's in a straight line. As you land, the knee is up, boom! And you go forward, and you either kick again, or, as I said, the defensive one. You hit him with the turning side kick, you miss, and then hit him with the front leg to get some distance. Just like a cheap. Yeah, like time. I think, but side is much more powerful. You got and your head's further yeah. away from the target. Get the glutes involved much more. Let's see what George's got. Kicking competition. <laughs> He's already champion. <laughs> That's nice. That was nice, nice man. Straight line. You're, you're, right now, you're already 50% better than when you got here. Yeah, knee up higher though. Knee up higher and kick lower. Yes! Remember, yeah, you don't want to even hit him here. You want to hit him here. You want to hit him, bam, right yeah. above his hip. Blast into those organs, right under that floating, floating rib. Yes! Oh, yeah. Straight line. Yeah, that's good. Yeah. I, was straight. That was oh, yeah. I would say, George, seriously, out of all the guys he's given pointers to, so far, you're hitting the hardest. Oh, dude, Definitely. he already had it. He knocked down Matt yeah. Hughes with it in their first fight. Yeah, but it was going up. Yes, yeah, so it went up, but it still landed it. I had before, and I got some guy, which I maybe get them, stop them, because they come on their way in and get ready. But I don't think I had a good mechanic even before. I don't think. Well, you just need some pointers, man. You just need to get I don't think I learned, I learned it right, you know? You, you I learned, learned this. Learning you learned this. this. You learned this. This is not good. See, this is knee down, foot up, and that's how a lot of people do it. The correct way to do it is knee up. You gotta have power right from here. You don't wanna wind it up, you wanna be able to throw it right from here. So if someone's coming at you, you can keep them, you keep them off like a jab. So after you land the first one, bam, say if you miss, the guy's right here, bam, you can get away. Just like a team, boom, bang. And you throw a hard one, and you can get your distance, and then you're, you're safe again. When you drill that, you do that spinning by kick with a knee high, and then you, you, you answer that. The most important thing to drill is the front leg. Drill this one first. Drill knee up and straight line. Knee up, straight line. Just drill that. Drill that in the air. Drill that in the bag. Yeah. It's fucking weird, the mechanic. Yeah, but when you add that to the kick, once you get the mechanic down, and then you add it to the spin, that's where all that power comes from. Yeah! Ah, you hear that? Uh, yeah. That would have been the best one. The deep, uh, the yeah. deep 
That's hard to Man, you're just you're just a, a couple thousand reps away yeah. to perfecting it. Exactly. Not that much, you know what I'm saying? Yeah. It's true. It's true. Because every everyone like the Joe throws, like everyone's perfect, hits the bag perfect, right in the middle, it's full power. Well he's already a Kyokushin black belt. He's already knows these techniques, you just gotta polish it. And yeah, but adjust. I think I learned it wrong, though. But you uh, I learned it like this. Yes. Nobody ever told yeah. me that. You know? The knee up is the best. And the knee up is a good defensive thing, too. You're, you're here. You know, it's hard to hit you with roundhouse kicks. It's oh, hard yeah. to hit you with mud. Yeah. It's a good technique, man. Fuck, man. This is very <laughs> The 360s is shit. That's the real one. Yeah, let's see that one. This is the, the Kong Lee Express. Hold on. Did you already show him this one? Yeah. That's the Conley Express. Stand south, Paul. Yeah, ready? Go for it. Oh, you missed one. I slipped. This is so slippery. As I'm stepping, I'm losing my footing. Give me a towel down there. Dude, you're damn. Oh, that's like a killer. He's murdering it. Huh? <laughs> slippery as fuck, man. This is like an ice skate right here. <laughs> nice. Hey, buddy. How you doing? about that turning sidekick. That was your shit too, right? Taekwondo? Back in the day. It's hard to relearn it later, right? It's better to learn it as a kid, the turning and the spinning and all that shit, and then add it to Muay Thai. It takes a lot of reps, and so when you're a kid, you're really open-minded, you're really flexible. I mean, yeah, I might agree that it's easier to learn early, but I don't know. I mean, look at Ariel Mastiff. I mean, he, he's not a young fighter. He's got the baddest spinning back kick hands down in the world. Like, watch him on YouTube against Peter Von Jacek. Like, you can see his foot coming out the back of Peter's rib cage during the fight. I mean, it's a badass fight technique. I mean, it just takes training, that's Super all. Super underrated at this point, though, right? And there's just only so many guys in the world that can do it, that's all, you know? I mean, but it's super badass. Centrifugal force is where you get your power on every single strike. Every strike is centrifugal force. So a spinning technique has that much extra force compared to a regular one where you're turning your shoulders 180 degrees. In a spinning technique, you're turning your hips and shoulders 360 degrees. So it's like double power. She's like a spinning back fist. That shit's powerful as fuck too. Oh, I can't curse. Huh? <laughs> are we on? Are we on HBO? <laughs> you're, you're on MTS. Man. There you go. I can say whatever the fuck I want, right? <laughs> we'll bleep you out. You know the children are watching. Yeah, right. <laughs>